Very well, everyone, and welcome back to Let's Play Indivisible. Last time, it, we took almost an hour to complete the to complete Port Marifa here, and there's more to do in it after we are we were able to get the ship. First of all, is this guy? Haha, <laughs> well fought, young ones. What? Hey, don't laugh at me and mess you up. Well, certainly I wouldn't want to meet the same fate as that tank. Right, so leave me alone. I've got a goddess to defeat. Kala, here we come. Kala, you say? Yeah, I say. What of it? It's just that I haven't heard that name for quite some time. Do you really think you can take on a goddess? I'm gonna get stronger. It never hurts to try. Haha, <laughs> right you are. Allow me to introduce myself. I'm called George, former commander of the Iron Kingdom, till a fool herons cost me a leg. Iron Kingdom? Are you gonna turn us in? Far from it. I no longer serve the Great Kingdom. They have no use for a damaged warrior and don't much care for their tactics these days. But I can be of use to you. You see, I trained you in Nomus, who helped seal Cal 16 years ago. I could train you the same way. Oh, that sounds good. Let's do that. But I'm not so mobile these days. I don't want to be a burden. No problem. I've got just the thing. Oh my. Yeah, people say that a lot. But as it's you say, it's the perfect th place to train. You could fight any manner of enemy you can imagine. Neat. Well, thanks, George. Happy to help. I'll be here when you need me. So, this guy, you meet him in the inner realm. You go all the way over here. So, you can basically do training. And you select your team, and you select either a bunch of small enemies, a couple of... I think this is a couple of Bellows, and this is a dragon we haven't met yet, so we're not even gonna see, show you. Yeah. And then you fight things, and there are different settings you can select. I think it's from the start menu. Yeah, you can make your ED zero, 0, always fill to max. Or you can make the enemies act fast, normal, or never. Make your actions re recharge faster. There's a little weird things looking at. It books display, I don't know why you would want this, but... Yeah. You can have some fun with this mode, train your combos and timings and whatever. And it's, it's a little fun. It's fun. I'm not gonna be here forever, so... Let's gonna leave, because we have a lot of things to do. And if you select an option called let's hear some pointers, it will give you like small battle tips. They're not that important, so I'm just gonna not bother. Yeah, now that we have this jump, we can actually go a little higher. I think, was it here? I don't know. It cannot definitely did not, cannot reach that. But there was another platform that I could reach, and I think from that one, I can I can jump to that ring zone. There are a couple of ring seals we can get right now for this new jumping ability we have. Also, combining with the dash is a very useful like this. There we go. If you go up here, there are two new NPCs. Huh? You wouldn't want you wouldn't be wanting to talking to talk to me now, young one. What I've got for sale ain't cheap. And then there's you. Darn it all. Hey, what's wrong? This old of mine is broken and I can't afford what I need to fix it. Oh, you're a musician? Some musician? A bunch of Iron Kingdom grunts broke my old, saying I shouldn't be playing in a public space. All I want to do is travel and spread my music. Ride the wave, you know. Yeah, I know. It's frustrating because I can't do the work myself, I just can't get materials. Well, what do you need? Monster guts from Tycoon from the strings, monster wood from canoe for the body repairs, and monster teeth from the Iron Kingdom from new turning packs. Though I'd settle for soldier teeth. Those are too small, even I don't that much. Right you are, I just wanted to show in their noses. Well hey, don't worry about it, I can get you all that stuff. Really? You would do that for me? Sure, I like music. Well thanks, I'm Zara, I appreciate the help. I'm Arjuna, I help everybody I see because I can't mind my own business. Well, I'm not gonna stop you, good luck. Come talk to me again if you need to know where the materials come from. And this is a little side quest that we can do. We'll keep that in the back of our minds as we go through the three places that we have to explore. But, over here, more importantly... Arr, I made a wall! What? What does that mean? Who are you? Oops, I didn't mean to yell that out loud. I'm Phoebe, pleased to accidentally make your acquaintance. That was quite the bellow. Well, I'm frustrated. My kids, gods love them, they're not progressing in their studies at all. My dad always macked me on the head when he felt like that. Did it work? You 100% did not. Gah, I knew it. Why are the little ones studying, if I may be so bold? To become great warriors, just like... Uh, to become great warriors, like their ma and pa, what else? Haha, <laughs> an admirable goal. 
See, our kingdom was peaceful, everybody has just enough to get by. But our neighbors to the west weren't satisfied with what they had and invaded us during our day of rest. The scoundrels! Our warriors were few in numbers, but fierce. We fought back, but eventually our kingdom fell. My husband fought bravely alongside me, but fell in battle. His dying words were to take the children and run. Oh no. I love running. I'm twice the fighter of anyone in my kingdom. But there were too many, and he was right. We escaped to the free port of Marifa, and I've been training my children to reclaim our kingdom once they're of age. Smashing! A woman after my own heart! I'd love to retake my own Shia kingdom myself. You all seem to have seen your fair share of battle. We fought all manners of monsters and beasts. What we should just be do next to help them advance? The next logical step is pairing with other people. Right, but there are a few examples of either their aids upon which to model their progression. Why, we got just the crew right here! Oh yeah, I'm 16. Ashina alone will be enough to pick your in children's interest. Brilliant, I'll spar with you and my kids can observe. Meet me just outside town in the Almuta Desert. I'll be right behind you. It's a date, uh, I mean, plan. Alright, we can do that. Why not? Also, uh, okay, Tungar is in the party. I'm gonna put Ginseng and I'm gonna put, instead of Balzai, you know, I'm gonna put Pushy. Kushi. We can have all the underage girls in there. Why not? Except for Tungar. Tungar is there because apparently he uh, he likes fame. So he deserves to fight. Oh, Balzai is here? Uh, what are you doing here, Balzai? Weren't you supposed to be better shape? Uh, whatever. I guess you're just. Here to drink something while you wait for me to do side quest. Well met, Fiend. Tungar, let's see what you and your crew can do, shall we? I won't hold back. Neither will we. And so we fight Fiend. She has a guard, we'll break the guard, go back there. I'm gonna raise you up. Two, three. That's gonna miss. No! That hit. Only once, but that hit. I'm surprised that hit. There we go. Oh, that's a piercing attack. I forgot about it. I really forgot what it attacks are. Okay, that's a, that's a juggle. If she hits you with that... Uh, she'll combo you in the air for a little bit, which is not great. Don't let her do that attack. She has a lot of HP. Okay, nice. I feel like... I'm gonna risk it a little bit. See if I can do something. Is that gonna hit? Okay. Don't attack Kushi. Seriously? You <sighs> I swear, every time I risk it with Kushi, sh they have to attack her. Okay, wait. Okay, no, wait, 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 wait. Don't attack her. Okay. Okay, that was a combo. And also hit Tungar in the back. It was that was weird. She's still blocking. Okay, one, two. Definitely gonna do that. Send her up. And we should get a... Anytime now, Kushi. From the sky. Nice. Love that attack. I'm on. There we go. Did that level three? Hell yeah. Forget that. It's a combo. Oh, that did a lot of damage. Okay, but I can heal that. It's not a big deal. There it is. Yeah, she does get more attacks as she gets weaker, so... There's that. One, two, three. Okay, raise her up again. Oh, nice. They hold three hit. Okay, that wasn't that great, but sure. Oh, you're blocking. There you go. Ain't you're blocking anymore. And that should be it. I yield. What an impressive display, young ones. They're something, aren't they? Hey, don't go talking, t taking responsibility for my work. <laughs> Apologies. I merely take pride in your strength. <laughs> I guess that's fine. Well, children, did you learn something? Yes, their movements would take months to study. I can really feel the ideas brewing. Hata! Well done, my babies. You know, if you'd like to observe closer, we'd be happy to bring you along. Hey, now you're deciding stuff for me too? Or, or that is, if his Ashina says if it's alright, and if you want to. Hmm, I couldn't leave my children to fend for themselves. We'll be alright, we got plenty to study up. 
Egan sketched all their forms out already. Wow, that's weird. Hmm, I suppose Port Marif is one of the safest places you can be right now. Well, then it's settled. I'll come with you if you left me. Sure thing, under one condition. What's that? Make sure Tungar stays in his place. Haha, <laughs> deal. Why, a Shaq Knight cannot be kept in any place. You heard the young lady? Yes, ma'am. Take care, kids. See you soon. Have a nice time, ma. The maternal Titan Phoebe joins your cause. We're gonna see her eventually, not right now. But now that we have this new jumping ability, we can actually go back a little bit. And see some stuttering loading transitions. Uh, yeah. This is the only way out of Marifa. You need that ability, otherwise you're not going anywhere. Can I go up here? No. Do I have to... Is this gonna be long? Because I might just meet you on the place. I think I have to go through this temple again. Which is having a hard time loading. Oh no, because I can do this. Right? Yeah, if I go up here. This is new. We haven't seen this part yet. This should bring me right next to where the boss... Uh, yeah. This is where the... There's another ring still there. We're gonna get basically to the entrance of the boss fight of Und. There's a ring still here. Oh, wait, no. Wait. No, wait, I can do this. Haha. Uh -huh. And this should be right next to that boss. Nope, I didn't mean to do that. Open the map. Yeah, there you go. See the pit? Right there. So we jump in the pit. And there's another ring still we can get in this area. Now that we have the super jump or whatever. That for later. Go up here. And it's right here. Uh, of course, I also need to jump correctly. Right here. And there it is. Yeah, so it's not that long. This is the only only other one, I think. Pretty much. Open the map. Uh, yeah, because that... That's nothing down there. Yeah, that's it. That's the only the only ring soul that we have left. Ten. I, rem I have ten. Let's see. Uh... And the Rino Realm. I want to check out with you. Yeah, you have 10. Hell yeah. Let's go. More defense. 15 is the next one. And you're still 20, right? Yeah, that would be a while. That would be a long while. No, we have to go down here. Yeah, I guess we can just do it on screen. I thought I had to go through the temple again, but you don't have to. I forgot about these steps. I thought I could just sprint all the way to Port Marifa again. Oh, well. It shouldn't be long, right? Stuttering a little bit. If there's one thing about this game that does, doesn't like flow specifically, particularly well, performance-wise, are the transition between areas. When you're in an area... I've never noticed like frame drops or whatever, but when you're in these like areas that are supposed to be in between two major ones, if you move too fast, you'll see that it starts. It starts tanking, and sometimes you'll even hit like a loading. That there you go. Sometimes you'll even hit the loading screen. If you move at normal speed, you, the game will have enough time to load all the assets, so it will seem like a seamless transition. But if you just dash through the whole place and just pull jump like that all the way, yeah. Things start getting funky. I never like glitch. The, you never like glitch out of bounds or anything like that. Sometimes you may walk on invisible grounds, but like, I've never encountered like a, a major game breaking glitch. Like maybe just invisible, invisible assets, and then eventually they just come back up. So yeah, nothing too important. But here we go. We are back at the port. And we can now set sail with the Teotl. Right, so unfortunately you cannot talk to your party members on the ship, which is a missed opportunity. I don't know why that you can do you cannot do that. They'll be in your inner realm, so I don't know why can I not talk to them on the ship I will. Never mind then. So where are we headed, they seed? So we can now go well, Port Marifa is where we are, but 
We can go to Daikrung, we can go to the Iron Kingdom, or we can go to Kano. We are kind of free to go wherever we want, except that we are not. You see, we cannot complete any of these places on our first visit, because we are missing abilities that are required to progress. Here's how it works. In Kano, you're gonna need an ability from the Iron Kingdom. In the Iron Kingdom, you're gonna need an ability from Kano. And in Taikrong, you're gonna need an ability from both the Iron Kingdom and Kano. So, the logical choice is, however, the Iron Kingdom, because in the Iron Kingdom, you get two abilities instead of one. You get one here, and you get one here. But here you get two, and you get one for free which then you can use to complete Kano, and after that, you can either choose to complete Taikrung or the Iron Kingdom. Because at that point, you're gonna have everything. Actually, yeah, the Iron Kingdom gives two abilities. Does Taikrung give two as well? No. Kano gives one? I th I'm, I'm pretty sure Kano gives only one, right? Yeah, I think it's only one, and then Taikrung gives... Yeah, yeah. yeah. It's two in the Iron Kingdom, one in Kano, one in Taikrong. I'm pretty sure about that. Oh well. Short, short answer, begin from the Iron Kingdom, and you'll be fine. like the breath of murdering dogs but ugh, you're right it's worse than I imagined what's all this slimy stuff ugh. oh oh my I want to live here Ashna let's live here gross it is it's so gross all right then Iron Kingdom I'm gonna change the party a little bit I'm gonna get Baozai in because I haven't actually told you anything about her other than how she fights. And then I think I want Kadira. Because she has in with the Iron Kingdom and Zebai. I haven't seen him in a while. And then we have NPCs to talk to. Hello, welcome to the Iron Kingdom. I'm not an official greeter or anything, I just like to stand here. Thanks. Uh, do you maybe know the precise location of the Sacra Gate? The what? How she quiet? Haha, <laughs> oops. You know, you look a, a bit like those people I saw in those wanted posters. What wanted posters? Oh, that's definitely not us. We're just regular cool folks. Folks who are leaving. Yeah, the cool thing about this place is there are wanted posters around, and you can if you just stand them and don't move. Yeah, <laughs> that's Jin Seganoni. That looks so cute. There's also one there on the foreground. Uh, it's a huge bird with a girl. Yeah, I can't really zoom in on that one, unfortunately. But yeah, that's supposed to be Alton, I guess. The Iron Kingdom! Which I was told is supposed to be... Great Britain? I don't really see what the similarities would be, other than they apparently are... A nation that likes to conquer other nations. That's the only similarity I can say. Oop. You gonna do anything? You... Yep. There you go. Oh, I got hit anyway. They use a projectile attack. These guys are gremlins, and gremlins, other than you might know them from the movie, the gremlins. But really, they originated from uh, from the early 1900s. They were monsters that the, they were thought associated with engine problems in planes. Wait, wait, wait. And go. Ah, that was hard to block sometimes. Uh, you know what? Let's do a level 2. This originally started in, in the, the RAF, so the Royal Air Force. They would say, oh, beware of the gremlins so your engine will will fail or whatever. There were like posters about it. I can show you in the screen right now. Uh, that's Rody, that's our companion that we don't have. So that, that animal right there, you saw it in the beginning of the game, in Ashina's house. 
if you have pre-ordered this game, you will actually have it around following you. Otherwise, you don't. I don't, because I haven't pre-ordered this game. What? My wallet is empty. Oh no, you got robbed? I guess, and it seems they left a note. Those with plenty have got to share. It's signed by the Iron Mouse. Hmm, so the Iron Kingdom is thieves too, eh? Sure do. They targeted my own just last week. We'll bring them to justice. I mean, maybe. Like if we see them or whatever. Okay, that's actually a good NPC dialogue there. I finally, want to, I finally made it to the Iron Kingdom. Jeez, it's a lot bigger than I imagined. Alright, need to get to work. Now it's going to accomplish my dreams for me. It won't be long until I leave this kingdom to reunite with my friends in Port Marifa. Getting out of the Iron Kingdom won't be easy and the journey to Marifa will be treacherous, but I will find a way to succeed. Oh, we, they're getting, they're just getting weirder and weirder. Also, there's the guy from the port there. I actually dubbed this the same NPC, though. Hey, where's my hat? Don't forget that tomorrow is all ours. Love and respect. Of course, love and respect to you. Uh, shoot. Long life and prosperity or whatever. Not so fast. Come on. There it is. Grab attack. There you go. So, Belzai. Since we have not talked about her yet. She's heavily inspired by Ching Shi, a notorious 15th century... Not 15th, sorry. 19th century female pirate. Who commanded a massive fleet, remained undefeated all of his career, and eventually retired peacefully after negotiating with the government. The name Baozi, Baozi comes from Baozi, however, that is Chinese for explosion, which very well fits her. As you may have noticed, that now when I'm blocking, um, I'm only I'm recovering one HP. So basically, my guard is now so good that my perfect parry is basically nullify all damage at this point. Nice, that was a that was good. Fifty two hits too. I mean, I don't have any actions anymore. Okay, good. I think that can go. Uh, that's not enough, apparently. Okay, I can block this now. There it is. And after we talked about Balzai, I can actually replace her with Dar. Because that's who I wanted originally. Storms are coming. Huh? War, I can smell it in the air. I sure hope not. I've seen my share and this feels the same. I can't go back to fighting their wars for them. My body can't take much more. I know the Iron Kingdom is expanding, but I hope it doesn't come to that. And then we have slime. Slime makes you jump further and higher. And that's all there is to it. And, oh yeah, this one. The wizards took my arms and turned you into this. I know they're close, Kane. With your abilities and my skills, we can finally stop them and set your spirits free. Why is that girl staring at us? Why are you talking nonsense? Who paid you? Who paid you to say that stuff? Oh, wow, okay. Yeah, right. I should have done the grab attack first. Oh well. Mistakes were made. But this should be it. Kind of. There you go. Gotta fight the fast fights. My troop is here to put on performance, a play about magic and the end of fate, but it has just been one calamity after another. Time is not on our side, but I'm sure you will get to see it one day. Maybe not, because you're just a random NPC that nobody cares about. Nothing this way? Okay, there is a- I know there's a gun up there, but- but... Whoop! You can grab this. Move along up here. Nothing on this side. Those gremlins, man, where are you? There you are. I'm still gonna get hit, yep. I hate these guys, because of their projectile attack that they attack you with. It's sorry- I mean, if you, even if you get the first strike, you're still gonna get hit. Still lots of enemies around here. I think I'm gonna focus on these guys. They're all in a line, I can just do that. Okay, it's only the Rompos left. And he doesn't have a lot much health left. My perfect parries. There you go. That's it. That attack, by the way, that down attack with Ashna with the axe is pretty powerful. Oh my god, am I gonna make it? Yep. Let's try like this. 
That works. That's the first try. Let's try this. Hell yeah. Oh, that comb was still going. Okay, never mind. It dropped it somehow. We don't have, like, Tungar to do big multi-hit attacks here. Uh, we can do this, I guess. Hmm, this is not very optimal. Oh, I missed that completely. I did not expect them to attack Dar. Let's just do that. Why not? Oh, we have a level 3. Hang on. That's what I can do. This is the only attack we have right now that hits everything. No matter where they are. Okay, moving on along. Do, 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 do. Not sure how much time I've been here, but I think I can. S I don't know. Do I want to move on still? Because there's a cutscene coming up. You know what? I feel like we we accomplished it enough for today. Yeah. So we can stop right here. Don't even have to save, but next time on Indivisible, we will continue through the Iron Kingdom. See you all then.